guys. Um, this is my post op knee brace. Um, this blue thing is actually an ice um, cuff, a cryo cuff. Um, that's the ice machine. Uh, sorry if there's some background noise. I have a fan on right now because it's kind of hot. And the ice machine makes quite a bit of noise. So if you can hear those really loud, I apologize. Um, anyways, I just wanted to update you guys and let you know um, what was going on. Unfortunately, um, I don't think I'll be able to do my Q&A video right now, but I did want to make some video for you guys. Um, just to tell you guys about the procedure and about just the overall condition. Um, anyways, I originally tore my ACL when I was 12 and I got knee surgery on it when I was 19. Um, and I ran cross country and track with a torn ACL all through high school. And um, not getting it fixed caused me to have a lot of long term problems. So in this procedure, the doctor microfractured. Uh, which means basically poked little tiny holes in the bone right out here where the arthritis was, where I had arthritis in my knee to regenerate the cartilage that I had lost in that area, hopefully. And in my ACL reconstruction surgery two summers ago, my other doctor had cleaned out my meniscus on the left side so I had no meniscus out here at all and the right meniscus going into this surgery was torn so in this procedure she transplanted me a new meniscus from a cadaver and then she cleaned out the meniscus on the right side so it's like new so my knee will hopefully be in pretty good condition once I go through physical therapy and rehabilitation. Um, yeah. Um, the first few days after the procedure were pretty difficult. Um, I was in a lot, a lot of pain. Um, probably some of the worst pain I've ever been in in my entire life and my pain medications just were not strong enough they just were not cutting it for me unfortunately so I just had to soldier it through luckily I did and I'm feeling a thousand times better now so I'm so thankful that the pain is gone um, yeah, I just wanted to make a video to let you guys know that I'm still here. I'm still thinking about you guys. I've been getting a lot more subscribers lately and I really appreciate every one of you guys. Um, you guys are the best. I don't get to talk to many of you, but I hope that I will going into the future. I try to respond to um, most of the comments that I get, and if I don't respond to your comment, I really apologize about that. Um, but yeah, the Q&A video that I was planning on making, I will definitely make that soon. 
Um, as you can see, my nails, I got the cut on my finger. As you can see, my nails aren't very long right now, so tapping might be a little bit difficult. So if you guys can think of something really relaxing you would like to see me incorporate into my uh, Q&A video, I would really appreciate it. I was planning on doing um, tapping and scratching on an iPad during that video, but I don't think I'll be able to with my nails so short. So I need suggestions for that. Um, but yeah, I'm doing much better now. Just wanted to update you guys, let you know how I'm feeling, uh, let you know that I'm doing okay. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't really know what else to say, except that I appreciate you guys so much. And I apologize um, for being away for a week. I've been trying to be more consistent with my posting. Because, um, you know, as my subscriber fan base is growing, I can't let you guys down. I can't uh, not make videos because I know how frustrated I get when I subscribe to somebody and get excited for new videos from them and no videos come so especially when videos are promised as I promised you guys so here's a video um, I'm sorry if it's not the most relaxing video of all time but um, I just wanted to update you all and let you know my condition um, it's good now. It's the brace and the ice machine and all of this looks really bad and it the procedure sounds really bad, but it's it could be much, much worse. It could be much worse. So I will be hopefully fixed and healed and back to normal by winter Christmas time. Um, a hundred percent hopefully um, but yeah we'll just have to see how my physical therapy